few months ago, I decided I wanted to get into the world of JRPGs, and what a better way than to play the beloved Final Fantasy VII Remake. By the end of the game, alongside all of my confusion at that ending scene, I decided I needed to see how the story concluded. Immediately after finishing Remake, I downloaded the original Final Fantasy VII and started playing it on stream. I knew nothing about the original story aside from what we learned in Remake, and unfortunately, that one big spoiler. Thank you, YouTube thumbnails, for spoiling me. But here is part one of my experience doing a full playthrough of the original Final Fantasy VII. Enjoy! What's going on? Whoa. Are we ready? Are we ready, y'all? <laughs> I'm excited. A new game. Do y'all have your popcorn? It is she. These graphics, oh my god. I don't know why there's a black bar at the bottom of the screen. <laughs> the graphics! <laughs> it is also crazy how similar this is. Like, this is so similar to the opening of Remake. With the train cutscenes and everything, it's so cool. Oh my god, look at these figures! <laughs> Let's go, Biggs! Beat their asses! <laughs> the boy come on newcomer follow me oh my god the polygons yo <laughs> Kristen I will come in all right y'all our first fight we attack oh shit all right we got one down Cloud, what a king. <laughs> Look at him swing the sword. Achievement unlocked. I won my first battle. Ex soldier, level six. Biggs. Wow, you used to be in soldier, huh? Not every day you find one in a group like Avalanche. Jesse, soldier? Aren't they the enemy? He was in soldier, Jesse, but he quit and is with us now. I didn't catch your name. Oh, so you can choose a name? Yo, this is your first time in a reactor? Yes. Oh, oh, <laughs> I forgot. No, after all, I did work for Shinra, you know. The planet is full of Mako energy. People here use it every day. It's the lifeblood of this planet, but Shinra keeps sucking the blood out with these weird machines. I'm not here for a lecture. Let's just do it. All right, you come with me from now on. Uh, so he went this way? Did Barrett just join my party by walking into me? <laughs> Is that what happened? <laughs> so maybe I was supposed to go over here. Just do it. I gotta watch to make sure you don't pull nothing. Fine, I'll do it. Watch out! This isn't just a reactor! <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, wait. Was that Cloud having a... having a flashback or... some sort of... thing happen? Heads up, here it comes. Oh no, is this the first big fight? Here we go, the Scorpion Sentinel. <gasps> Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Oh, and Barret has his limit. So does Cloud. Oh! So the braver move was the limit in this game? Go bear it, go. Yay! 
you all the music. Jesse, come on. You all right? Oh, it's because she fell. My leg got stuck. Thanks. <laughs> she just jumps over me. Jesse! Jesse! Come on! Oh! Oh my god, the graphics! <laughs> Look at that! Oh my god, Aerith! Excuse me? What happened? You better. Get oh. Uh, I'm gonna say you better get out of here. Really? I don't know what's going on, but alright. She just leaves! <laughs> the graphics! Okay, but the music though? Okay, let's talk to these people. Oh shit! <laughs> what the hell's wrong tonight? I was just sitting here drinking watching the news by myself. And all of a sudden, I get kicked out of the damn store. <laughs> What's with that? Is this Johnny? <gasps> it's Marlene! And Tifa! <laughs> Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? I'm gonna say not this time. Hmm, you've grown up. When you were little, you used to get into fights at the drop of a hat. Really? That kind of surprises me. <gasps> Tifa! Hi, bestie. You know, I'm relieved you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? That job wasn't even tough. I guess not. You're in Soldier. Make sure you get your pay from Barrett. Don't worry, once I get that money, I'm out of here. Cloud, are you feeling alright? Yeah? Why? No reason, you just look a little tired, I guess. Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you. Please join us. Cloud... Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying. Slowly but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. So, you're really leaving? You're just gonna walk right out ignoring your childhood friend? What? Sorry. <laughs> you forgot the promise, too! Promise? Remember? Cloud, it was seven years ago. <gasps> A cutscene? Oh my god, look at them. The polygons. Sorry I'm late. Come this spring, I'm leaving town for Midgar. I want to join Soldier. I'm gonna be their best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth, the great Sephiroth? Isn't it hard to join Soldier? Yes. I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Hey, let's make a promise. Um, if you ever get really famous, and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come and save me, right? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. Alright, I promise. They're so cute! I'm not a hero and I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Next to you, who wouldn't? <laughs> <gasps> oh no. <gasps> Papa. Sephiroth? Did Sephiroth do this to you? Sephiroth, Soldier, Mako Reactors, Shinra. I hate them all. Why is she in a cowboy outfit? So this is a control room. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I remember this from the remake. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Be able to do this.
Yes! Oh my god. That was harder than Elden Ring. Oh, you. You're the one who quit Soldier and joined Avalanche. I knew you'd be exposed to Mako from the look in your eyes. Tell me, traitor, what was your name? Cloud. Forgive me for asking, but I can't be expected to re remember everyone's name. Unless you become another Sephiroth? Sephiroth? Cloud really doesn't remember anything about him, it seems like. Another thing is, in the remake, I'm going back to when Tifa and Cloud were talking in 7th Heaven. In the remake, Cloud said it's been five years, but then in this game, she said it's been seven years since he left. So... I don't know. <gasps> Her face! They gotta go. <laughs> it's so dramatic. You all right? <gasps> oh, this is where we meet Aerith, right? Can you hear me? Yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. What do you mean by back then? What about now? Can you get up? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself now. I'll try. Take it slow now, little by little. Hello? I know. Hey, who are you? Hello? Oh. Look at this! Okay, let me put my headphones on because I want to listen to this music. You okay? The roof from the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky. Flower bed? Is this yours? Sorry about that. They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgar, but for some reason they have no trouble blooming here. Don't you remember me? I remember. Imagine if I said you're the slum drunk. Mm-mm. You were selling flowers. Oh, I'm so happy. You didn't buy any flowers for me, though. Nowadays, you can find materia anywhere. But mine is special. It's good for absolutely nothing. <laughs> good for nothing. You just don't know how to use it. No, I do. It just doesn't do anything. I wonder why. I feel safe just having it. It was my mother's. We don't know each other's names, do we? My name is... Eris? Should I do Eris or Eris? Respell it? Okay. <laughs> I'm Eris, the flower girl. Nice to meet you. Oh! <gasps> the name's Cloud. Look who's coming, y'all. Say, Cloud, have you ever been a bodyguard? You can do anything, right? Yeah, that's right. Then get me out of here. Take me home. Okay, but it'll cost you. Let's see. How about if I go out with you once? <laughs> okay, I don't know who you are, but... You don't know me. I know you. What? Oh yeah, I know you. That uniform. Hey Cloud, were you ever in Soldier? Dot dot dot. I used to be. How did you guess? Your eyes, they have a strange glow. That's a sign of those who have been infused with Mako. A mark of a soldier. How did you know th about that? Oh, nothing. Nothing? This guy is sick. <laughs> okay, wait. <laughs> when this was um, not translated correctly, yeah, it didn't say this guy is <laughs> sick. Hey, that man has a tattoo. I think it's the number two. Hmm, the numbers, the number tattoos. I want to know more. <gasps> Look at her house! Wow! 
Is Sector 5 or is Sector 7 far from here? I want to go to Tifa's bar. <gasps> is Tifa a girl? Yeah. A girl friend? Girlfriend? That's right. <laughs> Seem pretty tired. I haven't slept like slept in a bed like this for a long time. Oh yeah. Ever since then. What was that? <laughs> My how you've grown. Wait, what is this? Oh, this is a flashback, right? We saw this in the remake. Oh, but the girls never leave you alone. So true. There are a lot of temptations in the city. I'd feel a lot better if you just settled down with a nice girlfriend. You should have an older girlfriend. One that'll take care of you. I think that would be best for you. I'm not interested. You have to go through the slum in Sector 7 to get to Tifa's seventh heaven. I'll take you there. Come on. <gasps> Jump scare. Haley, thank you for the stretch and the hydrate, y'all. <gasps> what the hell? No! What? A house? What rank were you? Rank? You know, in soldier. Oh, I was... First class. Just the same as him. Same as who? My first boyfriend! I probably knew him. What was his name? It doesn't really matter! But yes, it does. Yes, it does. Oh, and here we go! Her in her dress! That girl on the cart was Tifa. Where was she going? She looked kind of odd. Oh, sheesh. We are at the wall market, y'all. And this music? I love it. This looks like the Don's mansion. I'll go take a look. I love how they call him the Don. I'll tell Tifa about you. Do you know what kind of place this is? No, what am I supposed to do? You want me- you want to go in with me? Well, being a man, that'll be pretty hard. Besides, if I bust in there, it'll cause too much commotion. What's so funny, Aerith? <laughs> Cloud, why don't you dress up like a girl? It's the only way. What? Just wait, I've got a cute friend I want to bring. <laughs> I can't wait to see how they do this. Pretty Cloud. Walk more nicely, like this, Miss Cloud. <laughs> Look at his pigtails! You're so cute, Miss Cloud. You want that look good on me too? Is it gonna be the red dress? <gasps> cute! This part of the remake was seriously one of the best moments in the game, in my opinion. <gasps> oh, this is scary. We all look so pretty! Clouds told me a lot about you. And you are? Don't worry, we just met. It's nothing! What do you mean, don't worry? About what? <laughs> don't misunderstand. Cloud and I grew up together, nothing more! Um, that's kind of rough because I literally told Aerith that Tifa was my girlfriend. Anyways. Alright, ladies, line up in front of the dawn. Woohoo, I've made up my mind. My choice for tonight is... This slender little girl, what? Aerith? Don, <laughs> you've got great taste. Aerith is so funny. Cause like, if that was me, I would be like, mmm... Mm, silence. We gotta save Aerith, oh my god. <gasps> Oh, what was that? Just wait a second. Oh my god, Don! Cloud! We gotta beat his ass. I'm sorry, Don. Don't say sorry, Aerith. Talk. If you don't tell us... I'll rip it off! Aerith, pop off! It was Heidegger of Shinra. Did you say THE Shinra? What are they up to? Talk. If you don't tell us... I'll smash it! 
You know what's going to happen? The plate will go ping, and everything's gonna go bam. I heard their hideouts in Sector 7 slums. I'm just glad it's not here in Sector 6. Oh, uh, I'm dancing. What's the problem, Reeve? You want out? No. But as head of the Urban Development Department, I've been involved in the building and running of Midgard. That's why... Reeve, flush your personal problems with the rest of your crap. The mayor's against this anyway. You're tired. Why don't you go take a couple of days off and go somewhere? Poor Reeve. I really feel bad for him. Oh no. How do I get over there? Fuck! Hmm... Where do I go? Go inside- You can move the trains? <laughs> Stop doing that. Cloud. Cloud, stop doing that. Oh! Y'all, what the frick? <laughs> we're on chapter 12! Oh no, we're gonna see our besties die, I'm pretty sure. Wedge actually dies here? Does he actually die here? Eris, do me a favor. I have a bar called Seventh Heaven in this neighborhood. There's a little girl named Marlene there. Don't worry, I'll put her somewhere safe. Oh, thanks! Cloud, so you don't care what happens to the planet? You're wounded. Thanks, Cloud. Don't worry about me. Barrett's fighting up there. Go help him. Poor Biggs! Is this Barrett? Oh no, it's Jesse! Cloud, I'm glad I could talk with you one last time. Don't say last. That's alright. Because of our actions, many people die. This is probably our punishment. No. That's all, folks. Mission accomplished. We have to disarm it. Cloud, Barrett, please. I can't have you do that. No one gets in the way of Reno and the Turks. <laughs> what? Did I just... Did I just fire Tifa? Reno, it's time. <laughs> oh, so he ran. Okay. Oh my gosh, and they have Aerith already! Sang. That's right, you'll have a hard time disarming that one. It'll blow the second some stupid jerk touches it. Our orders were to find and catch the last remaining ancient. Tifa, don't worry, she's alright. Oh yeah, Marlene. <gasps> How we- Oh my god, you bitch. Are we gonna be on a countdown again? I don't like these countdowns that they make us do. Um... <laughs> Oh my god, and the plate fell. <gasps> I cannot believe they did that. Still. Damn it all. What the hell's it all for? This was so sad in the remake. And it is still very sad here too. In my veins courses the blood of the ancients. I am one of the rightful heirs to this planet. Oh my god, is this is this Sephiroth talking? Sephiroth? Are you alright? Pull it together, man. Aerith is an ancient, sole survivor. What do you say? But aren't you her mother? Not her real mother. It must have been 15 years ago. During the war, my husband was sent out to the front. Some, fa some faraway place called Wutai. I went to the station every day. Then one day... Oh, Little 
baby Aerith, little polygon Aerith. Oh, she told me how she escaped from some kind of research lab laboratory, and that her mother had already to return to the planet, so she wasn't lonely. Many other things. I didn't know what she meant. I asked if she meant a star in the sky, but she said it was this planet. She was a mysterious child in many ways. Someone dear to you has just died. His spirit was coming to see you, but he's already returned to the planet. At that time, I didn't believe her. Several days later, we received a notice saying my husband died. This scene killed me in, in the remake. This is scary! Oh. Looks like the only way is to jump on the bar. Should make it if I jump before it comes too close. Press OK to jump. Uh. <gasps> oh no! Okay. We try again. Nice. Cloud is so agile. Hardest part of the game. <laughs> it took you so long, really. I'm a bit nervous. Also, I think it's wild how they just can walk up to the front door and go in here. Hey, you ought to know this building well. Not really, now that I think about it. This is the first time I've ever been to the headquarters. Do I believe that? I don't think Cloud knows what's going on. <laughs> Honestly. I don't know what to do. Okay, what if I bust in? If you don't have an appointment, you'll have to... <laughs> I don't need no appointment. This is an emergency. Anyone who don't want to get their face bashed better get out of the way. Oh, God. Look at all them guards running around. You go on ahead and signal us when it's safe to move. Um... Okay, here we go. Ooh, they're surrounding us. Okay. Oh! Oh my god! They do a lot of damage, actually. We got a tranquilizer. What? I gotta do it again? Huh? Oh, you sneak past them. Okay, okay. Oh! Okay. Okay. <sighs> okay. We did it. Now I gotta go. Fuck! Alright, we're good. We made it. Holy crap. You wanna get upstairs? I tell you what, if you can guess the password, I'll give you my key card. Guess the password. Get it on first try, I'll even throw in a special item. <laughs> God damn it. I was thinking it was the best because of what we did in the remake. Come on. <laughs> okay, what else is there? King, Orbs, Bomb, Mako, and Hojo. Can I just like keep guessing? Okay. <laughs> no! Not his entrance. Hojo, how's the girl? As a specimen, she's inferior to her mother. I'm still in the process of comparing to her mother, Ifalna, but for now the difference is 18%. How long will the research take? Probably 120 years! It's probably impossible to finish in her lifetime, or in the lifetime of the specimen too for that matter. Ugh, that's why we're thinking of breeding her. Then we could create one that could withstand our research for a long time. What about the promised land? Won't it hinder our plans? That's what I need to plan. The mother is strong and yet has her weaknesses. Gross. The Hojo guy. He's in charge of the Shinra Science Department. Cloud, don't you know him? I'm- uh, again, I'm just suspicious of Cloud. I don't think he- he's, like, withholding information. I think he just- I don't know. Maybe he got his memories erased. 
This is the first time I've ever actually seen him. So that's what he looks like. <gasps> is it red? Genova. <gasps> oh my god. What? That's all we get to see of that? Cloud bestie. Genova, Sephiroth's. So they brought it here. Cloud be strong. Did you see it? See what? It's moving, still alive? <laughs> Where's its freaking head? This whole thing's stupid. Let's keep going. Oh, I want to know more though. Oh my god, you can't just do that to us. So Ren was very vicious. What do you think you are doing? Lending a helping hand to an endangered species. Both of them are on the brink of extinction? If I don't help, all these animals will disappear. What? Animal? That's terrible. Aerith is a human being. He wants... Them... <gasps> yes! Yes, go off. Now's our chance to get Aerith. Thanks, Cloud. Hojo needs to die. I'm sorry. Hojo has named me Red13. A name with no meaning whatsoever to me. Call me whatever you wish. I wonder if we'll ever be able to find out his real name. Does the Promised Land really exist? I don't know. All I know is... The Setra are born from the planet, speak with the planet, and unlock the planet. And then... The Setra will return to the Promised Land, a land that promises supreme happiness. I remember this now. I remember this. We were like locked in that room, right? Locked in that room together? And there were the drawings on the wall? Just what does the planet say? It's full of people and noisy. That's why I can't make out what they're saying. I only heard it at the church in the slums. Mother said that Midgar was no longer safe. That is my real mother. Someday I'll get out of Midgar, speak with the planet, and find my promised land. I thought I would stop hearing her voice as I grew up, but... This is kind of eerie. Must have been attacked by... Wait. No human could have done this. Could this be Sephiroth? <gasps> Look at this blood! Genova specimen. Looks like it went to the upper floor. Oh! Oh, okay. It went to the upper floor using that elevator for the specimens. So, Genova got out. I remember that. <gasps> He's dead. The head of Shinra's dead. Sephiroth. Sephiroth came. Did you see him? Did you see Sephiroth? Yeah, I saw him with my own two eyes. He said something about not letting us have the promised land. And does that mean the Promised Land really does exist and that Sephiroth's here to save it from Shinra? So he's a good guy then. Do you know that Sephiroth is an ancient? Whatever, I can't let either you or Sephiroth have the Promised Land. Did they say that in the remake? <laughs> I thought they wanted Sephiroth and Aerith to, um, to breed. I don't know the right word for that, I'm sorry. So he's an ancient? Okay, I see. I guess we won't be allies. Oh god, here we go. Do you hear the music? It's so good. Oh my god, he's got his little hound guy. Okay, let's try ice.
<laughs> That's all for today. Look at his face. Yo! <laughs> this is so sick. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait. There we go. <laughs> this is so hard to control. <gasps> it's this thing. They really do have this thing on here or in this game. I don't know why I'm why I'm surprised at that. Nice! Yay! Sephiroth is alive. I have to settle the score. I'll go too. There are things I need to know. About the ancients? Many things. I guess it's goodbye, Midgar. Oh my god, we're leaving! Should we take Tifa and Aerith? I also kind of want to take Red too. Pick the girls? I think I'm gonna pick the girls, yeah. <laughs> there are beacons! <laughs> okay. Thought you'd do that. <laughs> Look how big this is. <sighs> Water? I feel like I should probably go towards the, the sea. What the frick is that? What's this? We've reached calm, we're already here? Oh my god! So let's hear your story. You know, the one about Sephiroth and the crisis of the planet? Let's hear it all. I used to want to be like Sephiroth, so I joined Soldier. After working with Sephiroth, on several missions we became friends. After the war, it was Soldier's duty to put down any resistance against the Shinra. That was five years ago. I was 16. No way. Oh my god. Look at him! Hey, how are you doing? I'm all right. I wouldn't know. I've never had motion sickness. Hey. Settle down. They gave me some new materia. Look at him doing squats. I can't wait to use it. He seems so excited. Just like a kid. You gonna brief us about this mission? This isn't a typical mission. Good. Why do you say that? I joined Soldier to be like you. But by the time I made first class, the war was already over. My big hopes of becoming a hero like you ended with the war. That's why I always sign up whenever there's a big mission, kind of a way to prove myself. Say, how do you feel, Mr. Sephiroth? I thought you wanted a briefing. Our mission is to investigate an old Mako reactor. <gasps> okay. Is this mission when he killed Tifa's... Was it dad? Mako reactor at Nibelheim. Nibelheim. That's where I'm from. Hmm, hometown. <gasps> Something strange just crashed into the truck. That would be our monster. No way! We actually get to fight as them? <gasps> he has so much damage! And it- what? What? No, <laughs> I'm scared! Sephiroth's strength is incredible. He is far stronger in reality than any stories you may have heard about him. So, where do you come in? Me? I was mesmerized by the way Sephiroth fought. And then we reached Nibelheim. It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? So how does it feel? I wouldn't know because I don't have a hometown. <laughs> Bitch, what? Um, how about your parents? My mother is Genova. She died right after she gave birth to me. My father 
Okay, I remember him saying this line when we watched the Ever Crisis trailer. Okay, my father... Is he crying? Or is he laughing? What does it matter? Does he have daddy issues? Shall we practice? Practice? Oh, you mean practice my pose? Do members of Soldier always have to worry about what others think? How did it go? <laughs> is it like this? His hand on his hip! So is that why Cloud always puts his hand on his hip? We leave for the reactor at dawn. Make sure you get to sleep early. I heard Sephiroth was coming, so I brought my camera. I want a shot of Sephiroth and a monster. <laughs> take my picture. I have to take pictures of nobodies. Hey, aren't you... Have I been here before? I don't remember. What? This is my house! It has nothing to do with what happened five years ago. Yo, wait, I wanna hear. Me too. You saw your family, right? All right. I don't know if you'd call it a family. My father died when I was still young. That's why my mom lived alone in this house. Guys, I'm so sad! Oh, guys. I'm so sad for Cloud. My mom, she was a vibrant woman, hadn't changed at all. But a few days later, she died. When I saw her, she looked fine. Hi, Mom. Let me take a look at you. So is this a soldier uniform? Mom, I... My, how you've grown. I'll bet the girls never leave you alone. So this is one of the cutscenes we saw. Cloud? You know, Cloud. Isn't that right? I'll always be your mother. Okay. Oh, <gasps> Tifa's house! Cloud, did you go in my house? I thought you might be home. Did Sephiroth burn down their village? Oh, closets. Orthopedic underwear! Tifa's underwear. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> I'm gonna say just kidding. I don't want to be weird. <laughs> Cloud, we're talking about something really important here. <laughs> A letter. Did you read it? My letter? You remember what it said? I remember clearly. It was a letter addressed to Tifa from the son of the guy that runs the general store. Tifa, how are you? I just arrived in Midgar eight days ago. Yesterday, all of Nibelheim got together to welcome me. The only person that we couldn't get a hold of was Cloud. But everyone said he wasn't really that close to us, so even if we asked, he probably wouldn't have come anyway. Aren't you Cloud? Don't you know me? You're Tifa's... <gasps> Tifa's father! Stay away from my daughter! Yikes. We don't need the Shinra's help to protect our town. This mansion... No, I'll come here later. I want to know what it is, though! Hmm? Cloud? Is it you, Cloud? It must have been two years. Say so you've really moved up in the world and being under Sephiroth's command. Hello? What are you looking at? The scenery. I feel like I know this place. I've hired a guide to the Maka reactor. I've heard she's young. <gasps> I hope we can rely on her. Isn't it Tifa? It has to be Tifa. Listen to me, Sephiroth. In case something happens... Trust me. I'll be alright, Dad. Oh my god, look at her outfit! I have two men from Soldier with me. I'm Tifa, nice to meet you. Tifa, you're the guide? Yes, we will do Space Cowboy time. This is all for Miss Tifa. It's too dangerous. I can't get you involved in this. There's no problem if you protect her. Mr. Sephiroth, please let me take one picture for a memento. <laughs> Look at this! 
Jeez. <laughs> I would like to see that picture. I'll give each of you a copy once I get it developed. Oh my gosh. I feel like we're actually going to be able to see that picture. The bridge! Whoa. <gasps> I can't believe this. These caves are intertwined like an ant farm. Oh, in Sephiroth, one person seems to be missing. It may sound cruel, but we have no time to search for him. We can't go back, so we must go on. We'll travel together from here. Bitch. This is... Do you see his HP? It, it does nothing! It does nothing! Okay, he has Revive, Restore. All these are like mastered too. Revive, Restore, Earth. All. Fire. Lightning and Ice. And what's this? A Mako Fountain. It's a miracle of nature. It's so beautiful. Look at her walk! Materia. When you condense Mako energy, Materia is produced. It's very rare to see Materia in its natural state. The knowledge and wisdom of the ancients is held in the Materia. Anyone with this knowledge can freely use the powers of the land and the planet. That knowledge interacts between ourselves and the planet calling it magic, or so they say. A man once told me to never use unscientific terms like mysterious power. It shouldn't even be called magic. I still remember how angry he was. Who is that? Hojo! Hojo of Shinra, an inexperienced man assigned to take over the work of a great scientist. He was a walking ma mass of com complexities. A Mako fountain. So this is where the knowledge of the ancients is? We finally made it. We sure took the long way though. Tifa, you wait here. Only authorized people are allowed in. This place is full of Shinra's industrial secrets. But... <laughs> Take care of the lady. Oh, she's angry. Mmm, man. <laughs> Genova! This is Genova, right? It won't open. This is the reason for the malfunction. This part is broken. Cloud, close the valve. Okay. Why did it break? Now I see Hojo. But doing this will never put you on the same level as Professor Gast. This is a system that condenses and freezes the Mako energy. That is, when it's working correctly. Now what does Mako energy become when it's further condensed? It becomes materia. Right, normally. But Hojo put something else in there. Take a look. I'm afraid. Look through the window, I'm trying! What the fuck is that? Do they put humans in here? Or members of Soldier? You're different from the others, but still human. But what are they? They've been exposed to a far higher degree of Mako than you. Is this some kind of monster? Exactly, and it's Hojo of Shinra that produced these monsters. Hojo's a little bitch. Normal members of Soldier? You mean you're different? Hey, Sephiroth. No. Was I? Hey! Hey! Was I created this way too? Oh my god, he's angry. Am I the same as all these monsters? Sephiroth. You saw it. All of them were humans. 
Ever since I was small, I felt that I was different from the others, special in some way. But not like this. No. That's really disturbing. Am I human? I didn't really understand what Sephiroth meant then. I was even more surprised that Shinra was producing monsters. Bitch, what the fuck? We returned to Nibelheim. Sephiroth confined himself to the inn. He didn't even try to talk to me. We found him inside the biggest building in Nibelheim. Is it the mansion? <gasps> A windy staircase? What is this? An apparently dead organism was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. Professor Gast named that organism Genova. X year, X month, X day, Genova confirmed to be an ancient. I don't know if Cloud should be here. My mother's name is Genova, Genova Project. Is this just a coincidence? Hmm. If he was born from Genova, that means he was born from, what's it called? This research specimen. Professor Gass, why didn't you tell me anything? Why did you die? Why do I feel bad for Sephiroth? Like, he still scares me, but also... I feel bad for him. I'm afraid. I, I feel like Cloud should not be here. Sephiroth didn't come out of the Shinra mansion. He looks so sad. He continued to read as if he were possessed by something, and not once did the light in the basement go out. Ruh row. What's up with that music? Sephiroth seems different. Is this where he, um, turned bad? It seems like he always had a hard edge, but I feel like that's just because he was a soldier and he needed to be that type of leader. And maybe this just set him off. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Who is it? Hmm. <laughs> Traitor. This planet originally belonged to the Cetra. Cetra was an... ...intinerant race. They would migrate in, settle the planet, then move on. At the end of their hard, long journey, it was said they would find the Promised Land and supreme happiness. But those who disliked journeying appeared. They stopped their migrations, built shelters, and elected to lead an easier life. They took that which the Cetra and the planet had made without giving back one wit in return. Those are your ancestors. Long ago, disaster struck the planet. Your ancestors escaped. They survived because they hid. The planet was saved by sacrificing the Cetra. After that, your ancestors continued to multiply. Now, all that's left of the Cetra is in these reports. What does that have to do with you? Don't you see? An ancient named Genova was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. The Genova Project. The Genova Project wanted to produce people with the powers of the ancients, or the Cetra. I am what was produced. Professor Gass, leader of the Genova Project and genius scientist, produced me. Now that's a sad life, isn't it? Sephiroth? Out of my way. I'm going to see my mother? Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Do you hear the music? I knew it. I knew it! Oh my god. Hey, it's you. You're still sane, right? Then come over here and help me. I'll check this house. You check that one over there. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be my house, isn't it? Can I go in?
terrible. Sephiroth, this is too terrible. Holy crap! <gasps> He's just killing everyone! I think Sephiroth could have used therapy. Yeah, I can fix him. <laughs> Actually, I don't think I can. I feel like he's too far gone. Oh! This is it. Okay. Sephiroth, Soldier, Mako Reactors, Shinra. I hate them all. I feel so bad for Tifa. No, she cannot go after Sephiroth right now. Mother, I'm here to see you. Please open this door. Is she really gonna talk to you? Oh my god. How could you do that to Papa and all the townspeople? Tifa not remember this? You promised. You promised that you'd come when I was in trouble. Oh my god! Poor Tifa. I feel so bad! The wings. Yo. Oh, mother, let's take the planet back together. I thought of a great idea. Let's go to the promised land. Sephiroth. My family, my hometown. How could you do this to them? They've come again, mother. With her superior power, knowledge, and magic, Mother was destined to become the ruler of this planet. But they... Those worthless creatures... Are stealing the planet from Mother. Oh my god. But now I'm here with you. So don't worry. He's crazy. Whoa. Why? What about my sadness? My family, friends, the sadness of having my hometown taken away from me? It's the same as your sadness. My sadness? What do I have to be sad about? I am the chosen one. I've been the chosen. I've been chosen to be leader of this planet. I have orders to take the planet back from you stupid people for the Cetra. What should I be sad about? Sephiroth, I trusted you. No, you're not the Sephiroth I used to know. That's the end of my story, Cloud. I'm sorry, I need more. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Wait a goddamn minute. In terms of skill, I couldn't have killed him. Official records state Sephiroth is dead. I read it in the newspaper. I challenged Sephiroth and lived. Why didn't he kill me? I'm alive too. A lot of this doesn't make sense. What about Genova? It was in the Shinra building, right? Shinra shipped it from Nibelheim to Midgar. Did someone carry it out later? It was missing from the Shinra building. <sighs> yeah. Okay, Sephiroth probably did that. Cloud? How bad was I after Sephiroth stabbed me? So she got stabbed. I thought you were a goner. I was so sad. I... 
the Ancients, Cetra, Genova, Sephiroth, and myself. Let's go, Barrett's waiting. I want Aerith to say something, though. What a fascinating story. <laughs> that was so much. <laughs> that was so much to take in. I know, Red was so unfazed. Red was like, interesting.